All right, guys. Well, I should say, hey, all you viewers of the name later, how are we doing today? After that last book I brought to the channel from Vet TV about military slang dictionary, and if you're curious about that book, take a look right up there. You're going to see a card for every single well, book review I've ever done. It should be one of the last ones. There was a very, very popular Facebook group out there called Awesome Shit My Drill Sergeant Says. Well, said. I think Facebook shut them down a while ago. I'm not sure. I know they had written a book a little while ago, and that's what we're going to take a look at today. Seriously, we are. This book is so God blessed funny. If you have ever served, you need this book. You can find it on Amazon as of Wednesday, May 25th, 2022. Really? I paid that much? For $17.99. Now, of course, you can find them used. You can find them other ways for a lot more cheaper than that. But brand new, right out of the, you know, the happy, happy box. Hold on. My kids are doing something stupid. Sorry, Kid Rebellion squished. It's been a while since we've had one of those. But still, um, interesting with that price, but still. The author of the book, as it says right here, uh, he is, Dan Caddy is a veteran of Operation Enduring Freedom. He he was the founder of, you know, the awesome Shut My Drill Sergeant Said Facebook page. Like I said, I think they shut it down. And he's the president and founder of Battle and Distress Incorporated. I'm going to try to leave a link to that right down below. All right. We've got, what, 173, 177 pages? But it just... It is full of Drill Sergeant fun. Like, you know, Drill Sergeant's not how to get your attention. Hey, you, with the face! Yep. Or, you know, Drill Sergeants want you to have situational awareness. You privates are so clueless you wouldn't notice a giant purple dinosaur climbing out of my ass. And that just makes me die laughing. <sighs> There's some I, I don't want to get demonetized for, but I love this. Drill sergeants know a lot about music. You privates sound worse than an octopus trying to mm, a set of bagpipes. Sweet baby Jesus. Uh, I love this. Drill sergeants really don't like failure. I swear if you fail this, I will slap you, then Jesus will appear and slap you for failing. <laughs> Or this one's great. Drill sergeants know how to deliver incredible news. Well, I have good news and I have bad news, privates. The good news is I save 15% or more on my car insurance just now. Bad news, I'm about to smoke the dog shit out of y'all after chow. <laughs> Drill sergeants know how to live dangerously. Privates, I have teabag bear traps. Don't piss me off. <sighs> Drill sergeants want you to stay hydrated. I will kick you in the ass so hard the water on my knees will quench your mother thirst. It's full of great little tidbits like that from drill sergeants. Everything from getting picked up to the reception center, everything going up through graduation. Like the one story they had in there like was three pages long and it had me dying with laughter. Where a private had a genius IQ and he was after he passed basic he was gonna go into OCS. He spoke seven language seven languages fluently. But he pretended like he really couldn't understand English throughout the whole basic training cycle until the last day he got caught. And his drill sergeant was like, oh, hell no. I own you for three more hours. Time for some corrective training. Because he got over on him for two months with the, huh? What? Huh? I, I, I. And the drill sergeant enacted revenge. I love it. Or the one that, you know, I, I, I told my son and he goes, daddy, I can see you saying that. He's like, Private, I will kick you so hard in the chest plate, your baby will be born with a birth defect. No, a birthmark. Excuse me, a birthmark. I was just like, oh, you got to be kidding me. That is freaking priceless. He's going to kick him so hard, it's going to transfer through the sperm. But I, I know this one is really, really short. Um, I don't believe that that was an actual signed book. I believe that was just something they put in there, you know, the usual script copy. But it's it's an amazing read. It will give you a really, really good laugh. It took me about an hour to get through everything. Well, hour, hour and a half, because I was laughing so hard I had to wipe tears from my eyes. It brought back a lot of good memories of hanging around a lot of good sergeants. And if you've never been to BASIC, I suggest buying this book. 
because it's going to give you an eye opener. The only way I can describe this is I want you to go to the Angry Cops YouTube page. I want you to watch some of his videos when Angry Drill Sergeant takes over, okay? How you've got, you know, Richard right there, and he's walking, he's like, ah, my drill sergeant senses are tingling, and then when he disappears, he's like, no, no, I want to keep the stash, I want to keep the stash. He's like, ah, pops back up, and the drill sergeant's like, yeah! That's how they are in the reception center. They're rich. They're nice, they're calm, they're polite. But when you get on that cattle car, and you go to basic, and you become theirs, they are the Lord God Almighty, and they will kill you if they want to. Drill sergeants are your first foray into the NCO Corps, and how it should be when it was when I went back to 389. Not the horror stories I'm hearing now, where privates have more control over the drill sergeants than the drill sergeants have over the privates. But that's just me getting off on a rant. You may have noticed I did a little rant called My Advice to Brand New Privates on Social Media because some of the things I'm seeing, I'm like, <laughs> if that had ever happened in my day and we had the internet, you were doing that, we'd be dead. My sergeant would be out of my freaking barracks door in seconds going, let's talk. Get a water source. You're about to die. Yeah, but still. Now, I know I'm keeping this one a little short because I could read these all day long. I, I just... <laughs> Sometimes you can actually impress a drill sergeant. Private, I used to think you were the most useless human being I'd come across in all my years on this earth. But then I realized, you're a beacon of hope. Or the other one I saw in there when a drill sergeant was talking about, you know, how did you shave, Private? And he's just like, did you shave with a bowl of milk and an angry cat? I'm like, damn. He must have had nicks all over his face and everything. <laughs> I just, or he's like, Private, you're so ugly, you look like someone set you on fire then puts you out with a wet chain. Sorry. <sighs> but okay. So, like I say, <coughs> I want to know your questions, comments, love, hatred, anger, all that fun stuff right down below in the comment section. Have you read this book? Were you part of that Facebook group? Because like I said, I believe Facebook shut it down. I really truly believe it's gone. I did not check. And yeah, I'm still... <laughs> it, it's a great book. Pick it up. It's beautiful military humor at its best. And if you're a veteran, you know we have a dark sense of humor, and you're going to love this book. Also, if it made you laugh, made you cringe, made you cry, made you do anything during this video, please hit that big old thumbs up. It's only going to help trigger that algorithm, and that's really, really important. We're kind of growing, and I really would like this book to get out there. I know it's been out for a while, but still. You know, hitting that thumbs up really is going to help the channel. But there we go. My really quick, brief look at awesome stuff, well, awesome, my drill sergeant said. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope all of you are having a great day, a safe day. I'll see all of you in our very next video.